Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and for those who have already watched my previous videos, thank you so much for coming back and today I would like to show this bracelet I made and I call this the second variation of the flower chain bracelet because it's the same flower part and the leaf part as the one I made the tutorial I made just uh, um, yesterday and the only difference is the spiral IV part which are between the flowers and for this tutorial I use the same colors very similar colors pink yellow and green as the way I used in this one so up to the part that I just explained on the next clip, please check the tutorial I posted on March 10th and follow the chapter one from chapter one to chapter four. And I explained there the number of threads, the length, how to make the loop and how to make the flower. So in the next clip, I'll start from the spiral part. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so here I knotted up to the flower part and I actually just did a few spiral just to practice before explaining to you. And the it's you can see that the colors I used for the corresponding place are the same, just different shades of pink, yellow, and green. So now we, I, I assume you have the same setting. So the two pink outside and the other threads in the center. And I'll start from the right side. So for this one, one thing uh, you have to keep in mind is that the cross of this yellow, green, and the pink, the way you cross should be always the same. And here I explain the way I did. The yellow, green, left top to the right bottom over the pink, like this. This is the cross I always use. So now I use macrame technique. So it's not hard. It's uh, basically the same thing, just the opposite direction from a friendship um, bracelet knot, forward knots and backward knots. So do like this. And this is the kind of leading line. And this is to wrap. You put this inside here. Then this yellow green should be straight and then go all the way up. Do it twice. So yellow green left top to right bottom over the pink. Then put this one inside. all the way. Now, for this side, we do the same thing. So that means we have to kind of spin it so that you can easily see the green yellow from left top to right button over the pink this cross do the same thing this pink goes inside this space and do it again so this one goes over I haven't let this go 
just pulled and don't let this go because it's easier to do the second knot you just finish the first knot to each and now the one you just finished the yellow green keep it inside your hand and then we pick the other pink thread that you just didn't use so this is the one you just use so the one which you didn't use, you can see, you can make a cross. Left, green, yellow, left top to pink, uh, oh, uh, to the right button over the pink. And then again, same thing. Put this inside here, pass it through. yellow green straight and wrap it twice that was the one of the second knot now we have to use the other one so this one and now we just move and green left top to right bottom over the pink and then put it from the up side now it's getting a little twisted and always twice okay. so we finish two knots each and when you finish Keep the green and yellow on the right hand always, so that it's easier to proceed. Now we go to the third knot. So it's already kind of in the back. So we just finished here. So the other one, put it aside. And now we do with these. Do the same thing on this one. This will be the third knot. It's becoming three dimension, as you can see. Then when you do the 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 other half, so this will be the third knot, both side third knot. Keep this one in your hand, and then you meet the other pink like this. Four. And when it's spiral, just kind of follow that. side of the, the fourth one it's kind of twist and make sure four this will be the four of the second side now don't let this go and you can see naturally the pink is right there to make the fifth knot. So the left top to right bottom over the pink. Always this rule. Five. Now do 
the other side of the half-parted knot. Keep the yellow green, make the other pink for the sixth knot. side of the sixth knot and I want to do seven for this bracelet. So keep this one and make this pink here. I can naturally now after a few knots it's kind of natural to make the knot because the string actually is right there. So seven. Then do the last one. And it's two, so Top to right bottom, and the second time too. So just cross it and so now I think. So this is how that you just have adjust a little bit and you're done for the spiral part. And you're back to the place where you started. So two yellows and two greens in the center. And the pink on the outside. Okay, so here I finished the bracelet and I made six flowers and five spirals in between and the numbers, number of the flowers are the same, it's just that they're a little shorter compared to the first one and this is about 13.5 centimeters and the first one was like 14 centimeters and how I ended here you can check the chapter six, um, the, the tutorial video I just made before this one, and two, uh, three strand braid, and just um, that's how I ended. And hope you enjoyed um, watching this tutorial, and uh, I hope you enjoy making it too. Thank you so much for watching and hope to see you soon.